best food truck places on Maui. Here in Kihei, there are many. And actually, um, yeah, it's a food truck pod that we're visiting. Last um, video, I shared with you about the South Maui Gardens. And in this video, I'm going to share with you the Maui Food Truck of Kihei or 808 Maui Food Truck of Kihei. And this is the one behind the Azekas. Many of you are familiar with this because um, this is one of the original food pod um, trucks or food truck pod here in Kihei. So let's go and uh, find out. Um, I wanted to do a regular, um, actually, a more um, like cinematic video, but we're running out of time and I needed to upload another video. So I'm gonna do this all by myself. I hope you stay along with me. There are a lot of great food trucks here, so let's go. Okay, let's start the tour. As you can see, the Seca Mauka sign is behind, and also that food truck pod um, new logo or new uh, poster that they have right now is here. And also the Kraken Coffee drive through sign. So, yes, that is one of the main food trucks here. And it's very, very popular. It's a good coffee. Um, they originally started here. They have several food trucks now in different pods, but this is the original place. And as you can see, you can drive through um, right there. So you just go in this side and um, there's a little bit of line, but they're fast. So um, don't worry about waiting so long in your car. And it's, as we can see right now, this is another popular food truck here that people come for. The sun out buns out and their ube bao is the best. So we'll get into that a little bit later. But I just want to show you where the, the food truck or actually where the car will go as you enter for the crack and coffee. There's another little breakfast and lunch food truck right here. Okay. And so there's the entry right there. And so um, I'm gonna turn around. It's a little bit. Oh, oh, a lot of people coming. I think it's, yeah, it's their busy time right now, I can see. And okay, let me just scoot right here. A little bit in this little section, so I can go ahead and show you this beautiful place. They added shades in between those cabanas, which is really very helpful, making it um, more comfortable and less sunny as you eat. But um, yeah, and they added plants, which is really good too. And so, okay, um, today is a Sunday morning. That's why a lot of these food trucks are still closed. And also, um, yeah, they're still closed because it's a Sunday morning. And, um, but this is the only time I can come here. So I thought I'll just show you. It's similar to what we did on the, um, Salt Maui Gardens where I showed you a lot of the food trucks are closed because it's too early morning. Many of these food trucks will open around lunchtime, but uh, we're catching them right now very early. So actually, let's start with this, this fruta because they're open because um, it's fruit. I think it's um, they're doing some repair in there. Okay, let's start here. Life of Thai is a Thai food um, food truck, and it's really good. We tried it, and um, let me show you what you can buy from there. Reasonable price, big portions, and authentic Thai food, and the owner. Chef is very friendly and um, yeah, so if you're into Thai food, I highly recommend trying this food truck. Okay, so 
Yeah, I apologize if I keep on going around. I'm trying not to make it easy, but I also uh, just really want to be able to capture some of these food trucks for you. Okay, so this, they're working on this, this food truck. It's the new one. Um, I haven't seen it before, but I'm glad they're here. It's a lot of fruit on the menu. And then this is your Kraken coffee. So you can order from the inside and also um, from the drive-thru. So from the inside of the pod, they have a window and then also drive-thru. So they're very busy right now. Next to Kraken is this freshly caught sushi and poke. And um, it's A or it's O A O, um, which is actually pronounced as wow. I know it's kind of tricky, but it's a wow sushi though. And the interesting thing about this sushi place is um, they started here as a food truck, but now they're so successful because they're really good that they open up um, brick and mortar in a restaurant at the shops, uh, not the shops, oops, at the um, Wailea Gateway Center. And it's very successful if you want a sit down restaurant for sushi. That's where you should go. But if you want to just go grab some sushi and go, or just enjoy it along with the other food truck food, then you can go to their food truck here at the um, Nakihe pod here. So anyway, so you want me to show you some of the rolls? Let's see some of the prices. So right here. Okay, this one is closed right now, but this is, oh, the Nani part. This is um, one of the OGs also here. One of the original and originals. And let's see, why can't I find their name? But um, I think this is the Nani Pirate, if I'm not mistaken. And that's the food that you can order. Prices were change. You can't see the prices anymore. But um, actually, there are some prices like this one 17. We got crispy wings 14. But anyway, um, yeah, I tried this too. Their tacos are really good. So if you're craving for tacos and you're in this pod, this is the way to go. Okay, this is something new, the Bagel Shack. New addition to this pod. And they're open because they're basically um, serve breakfast. Actually, they said they serve breakfast and lunches. So, um, yeah, omelets, sandwiches, panini. Let's go closer to what you can see. Next one, and this is Vidad's. They're closed on Sundays, but um, yeah, they're open other days. And this is um, one of my favorites because I love Filipino food. <laughs> but they also sell, you know, local, not just Filipino, local, uh, Hawaiian, Asian food. Um, you get a lot of choices. Of course, don't forget the halo halo because the best dessert as far as I'm concerned or one of the best but um, there is um, shave ice also if you 
you are craving for shave ice. Let's, let's look at some of the food they have right here. The bowls. They don't have the prices here. But look at this special. It's got 17. Fried a pool is $10. Oh, they got pug smoothie. That is cool. $6. If you haven't had pug yet, make sure you have a pug here. So they have, okay, let me get closer. Some of them right there. Oh, there's prices actually. $17, $12, not bad. $13. Chicken katsu, $13. Oh, these are reasonably priced pork adobo fried rice so yeah i think this is something great in simon they have simon too pancit oh i love pancit so i will be back here when they're open i know they're closed on sunday but um this is the only time i can do this right now so i just have to do it for now and we'll just come back another um great Food truck here is this, but sun's out, but's out, and um, I think they're gonna be open later on. It's at 11 o'clock. See, these are mostly the kind of um, hours they have here for those who just serve lunches and dinner instead of breakfast. They open at 11 o'clock. So um, yeah, and they cater too. But their ube bonds are so, so good. They're always selling out. Look at that. They still have a sign here. Sold out of ube bonds. This is probably from last night. That they sold out last night. So, um, yeah. So, if you're wanting to try something different, try the ube bond. If you haven't had it yet, because it's so good. And, um ice cream bowl with ube ice cream Ooh, i've had that too and it's really yummy so right there okay so now another a newer one just because maybe i haven't been here for a while which i definitely will be coming back here and eat more here is a maui shrimp oh let's look at maui shrimp express And all plates are $14.95. Not so bad, yeah? $14.95. It's still affordable for, um, or the right, you know, reasonable price for Maui. And so look at all these choices. So yummy. If you're like me who likes shrimp, definitely come here. Okay, again, they're closed. They're going to be open 11 o'clock. But, um, on the other side of the shrimp same truck but they also serve burgers so shrimp or burger it's your choice um and the price is 14.95 okay here you go there's another truck Okay, and next truck is, okay, this has been here for a while, this is Southern Barbecue. So Brothers, Southern Barbecue, they're closed, they're probably open around 11, but let's look at their menu. Have some 17 too, but the ribs there's 20 88. Their price has got some kind of interesting ending 20 88, 17 90, or 17 30. I think they made it uh, intentionally just to make it hard for the cashier. <laughs> so, anyway, um, oh, I have said anyway so many times, I'll stop that, but 
that is Soul Brothers Barbecue. So there are a variety of choices here. This is so cool. Okay, Teppanyaki Barbecue Grill. Ooh, I haven't tried this yet. Um, they don't have much photos. Maybe um, they want it that way. But um, Teppanyaki is always good also. So it's worth trying when they're open. Let's see, I'm just gonna do a little span around here so you can see what it looks like. I hope you're enjoying this. Um, if you have not met me yet, or if this is your first time, my name is Lisa and I am the blogger for a Maui blog. I also am an author of the book Maui Now and Beyond. It's a Maui travel guide that you can find at Amazon. I had the first book and I'm working on the second book which will be out soon, the second edition I mean. Okay, there are some noises here. I hope that's not gonna annoy you, but they're working on something. So anyway, oh, I said that anyway again, shucks. Um, let's, those are just where, that's where the noise is coming from. Okay, so what is this one? Tacos Ash. So another taco place but I think they have something different or interesting let's try the tomato by the time I <laughs> spend. No, just kidding. Okay, so it's really good to support these local businesses on Maui right now. Um, it's just a difficult time. You know, after the fire, we have less visitors, so the locals are trying to support um, the local businesses. But um, if you're visiting, uh, make sure that you um, also try to support these local businesses on Maui. Okay, so let's see here. I'm so glad they have this shade. It's so much cooler. Oh yes, that's the Nani Pirates. Now we know. And look at the light. I mentioned earlier about the other food truck pod I visited. And if you want to see that video, um, you can just right here or anywhere. <laughs> You'll see it up here. The link going to that other video and it'll be fun to watch too thank you again and i'll see you next time aloha